Questions without notice. Are there any questions? And I give the call to the honourable member for Menzies. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. My question is to the Prime Minister. Brendan's Quality Meats in my electorate has been serving our community for 42 years. Owner Brendan says he has seen the impact of rising cost of living in his customers, saying people have been increasingly switching to cheaper meats. Will this out-of-touch Prime Minister finally admit that Australian families always pay more under Labor? Order. I give the call to the Prime Minister. Thanks very much, and I thank the member for Menzies for his question. And certainly, I say to him that he can uh, inform Brendan that certainly all of us in this chamber should be aware of the pressures that are on over cost of living. Uh, cost of living is a result, direct result, of the inflationary impact that, of course. Uh, in the beginning of March 2022 quarter, uh, before this government was elected, is the highest, the highest jump in inflation uh, that we have seen this century of 2.1 per cent. So I'm sure that Brendan uh, is conscious of that, and I'm sure that the member for Menzies would inform Brendan of that uh, accurately. Uh, we have taken action, and we know that there's more to do. One of the things that we've done to take action, of course, is pharmaceuticals, where we've cut the price of PBS medicines from $42.50 down to $30. The, member for the, Casey. First, the first cut in the cost of pharmaceuticals under the PBS in 75 years since the former the Labor government member for uh, created that. Of course, we know uh, that uh, when those opposite had uh, the opportunity under the leader of the Barker opposition the as the, the health minister. His idea, his idea was to put a tax on people visiting the GP of seven dollars. His other big idea was Order. to increase the cost of prescriptions by five dollars. But the other idea that he had about cost of living was to remove the restrictions on state and territory governments that prevent hospital emergency departments charging a fee for presentation. Order. The Prime Minister will just pause and I'll hear from the Manager of, of Opposition Business on a point of order. Well, Mr Speaker, on relevance, on the 8th of February you directed the Prime Minister back to the terms of the question after he spent more than a minute attacking the Opposition and not directly engaging with the terms of the question. He's doing the same thing and I call upon you to rule as you previously did. I'll hear from the Leader of the House. Uh, Mr Speaker, I, th uh, I think from recollection that ruling on the 8th of February was dealing with a question that didn't have a tag nearly as broad as the one that was just asked. The question was about cost of living in particular with but order. The member for Hume regarding the cost of living prices rising and a political tag at the end of the question. Uh, about the Prime Minister's commitments, and I'm going to give him the call. And if he is not being relevant, he'll be drawn back to the question. Thanks and listen much. carefully to his answer. Thanks very much, uh, Mr. Speaker. I was talking about the cost of living, and imagine the cost of living increases if uh, the former Health Minister, the now Leader of the Opposition, had have got his way and removed the restrictions on state and territory governments in having hospital emergency departments Order. paying a fee to visit. Now, the, deputy leader, the deputy leader says, is that all you've got? Order. They members show on my, contempt on my left for the issues rejecting. of the costs of health care and how important they are to cost of living. Or, to cost order of the living. Minister for the Home same Affairs. People, the same people who uh, opposed the, and still oppose the one and a half billion dollars we have for energy price relief to take pressure off the cost of living, come in here and just show Order. how out of touch they are, how they're against absolutely any initiative Prime that Minister's is put time forward. Has concluded.